Namaste, Namaskar, Vanakam, Sastrikam, and welcome back to Grow with the Jan family. I'm Anjali. And today we're going to be reacting to the well awaited Imran Khan and Prime Minister Modi's speech at the UN. So we've done a few things this week on both of them. Uh, Howdy Modi with Trump in Texas, that was amazing. Um, to listen to the, them speak and then we did you know some you know pros and cons for both of them like what was going to happen what's happening coming up for the UN speech lots of anticipation and um, I think kind of what we were anticipating you know one talking more about growth and economy and one talking more about Kashmir and um, kind of is what ended up happening. So this is kind of the highlights from the speech. And um, let's start it up and see what they both had to say. So. Yes. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. I want to talk about a lot of problems, but just for today. We problems. have a lot of ideas. Lots of problems. A lot of problems, but, but I only have four to As said, ideas up. without funding is mere <laughs> hallucination. Without asking in my country, in when my party came to power in the province of KP, we planted a billion trees in five years. Wow. Now we've set That's us amazing. a target of That's 10 the billion kind of trees stuff in you Pakistan. should talk about. Richer countries must be pushed. Good. We do not have the sort of money to have expensive lawyers and spend millions and millions of dollars. We need help from the rich countries. No, but Bring your ideas Unless to the, the table and ask for money that way. To Don't stop ask economic for refugees handout. coming as we see right now. Yeah, and swipe they must Trump. take action. They must take mm -hmm. action now. Why shouldn't rich people pay taxes? My third point. My they third do. point is Islamophobia. It's Muslim women terrorism. wearing no, hijab, it's become don't. an issue. And Some trying of the to people who ended terrorism. up as militants in Syria and other places were from marginalized Muslim communities. Because the 9-11 bombers did a suicide attack, all yeah. sorts of theories came up that the Muslims uh, uh, are involved in suicide attacks because that's they will because get virgin in heaven. That's what they heavens. tell people. Yeah. No one did research that before 9-11, the majority of suicide attacks in the world were by Tamil tigers. Who oh, pointing God, fingers again. Strange things about Islam, that it is against women, yeah. it's against minorities. We did something, they trying to convert not, people. Yeah. The number fourth point, Mr. President, the reason is the most he came critical point, to the UN, is the right? reason yes. why I especially we came here. here. Mm -hmm. It is about what is happening in Kashmir. We had been through this war on terror, we joined the United States war on terror after 2001. 70,000, 70,000 people killed in a war we had nothing to do with. No Pakistani yeah. was involved in 9-11. Yeah. A 20 so year, a lot in year old in Pakistan, Kashmiri boy base, right near the army whose base. father said was radicalized by the security forces in Kashmir, blew himself up on an in Indian Pakistan convoy. Pakistan has nothing to do with it. Terrorist. Immediately, we, uh, India blamed us. <laughs> Mr. Narendra Modi is a life member of RSS. And it's arrogance that has blinded him. Now he's From the fact that what is going to happen when the curfew is lifted? Look, what is going to happen when the curfew is lifted will be a bloodbath. <sighs> There'll be a bloodbath. And there is always a danger of another Pulwama that 180 million Muslims You're of India are thinking right now. making this stuff What do you think? Worse. Don't you think yeah. that the Muslims will be radicalized in India? Yeah. I there are a myself. lot of good Muslims out there. I'm We've done reactions on them. Would like, I, yeah. everybody is not would bad. I want to live this humiliation? Just because they're Muslims. Oh. Would I want to live like that? You're justifying terrorism. You're forcing people. Oh, Supposing even the UN people don't want to hear them. Smaller yeah. than its neighbor is faced with the choice. Either you surrender or you fight for your freedom till death. Mm. What will we do? 
I asked myself this question. Starting war. Why? My, my belief is, la 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 la. There is no God but one. And number one action must be that India must mm. lift this inhuman curfew. But nobody has died, yeah. and people are not saying it's bad. The curfew is keeping people safe. Uh, yeah. And pick up a gun. I mean, he's blaming people, begging for money. Bring ideas to the table. So like, they will give you money. Yeah. They'll so the good thing he did yeah, was, a, was planting the trees. And he talked yeah. about doing more. Talking That's where he should be going with this. The other Ma side, Vishwa. he's like terrorism. Mahatma and, Gandhi ki. Uh, such negativity. So, you can definitely hear like the difference in the voice. Like there is Imran is like screaming, and he's more like yeah. calm. Talking positive, you can feel it. Yeah, there is such a difference, like negative and anger, and peaceful and working together. Yeah. Right? Gandhi's birthday is coming up. Swash Bharat was a huge success. Health assurance I'm sorry, I'm calming down. I have to be on the screen. Wow. Largest of all insurance. Yeah. Giving insurance to the poor. That's amazing. The world's biggest digital identification program is running. I want to tell you this meeting. Yeah, it's a great moment for the world. Yeah. That today, when I'm talking to you today, तब इस वक्त आज भी हम पूरे yeah. भारत को सिंगल यूज प्लास्टिक से मुक्त करने के no लिए एक बड़ा yeah. अभियान चला रहे हैं। आने वाले पांच वर्षों में हम जल संरक्षण yeah. को बढ़ावा देने plastics. के साथ ही पंद्रह करोड़ घरों को पानी की सप्लाई से जोड़ने वाले सवाल ये है कि आखिर ये सब हम कैसे कर पा रहे हैं भारत हजारों वर्ष really पुरानी good. एक महान yeah. संस्कृति है हमारे संस्कार हमारी yeah. संस्कृति जीव में शिव देखती है इसलिए हमारा प्राण तत्व है कि जन भागीदारी से जन कल्याण और ये जन कल्याण भी सिर्फ भारत के लिए नहीं जग कल्याण के लिए हो तीन हजार वर्ष पूर्व तीन हजार वर्ष पूर्व भारत के महान कवि कन्यान पुंगुन रनार उन्होंने विश्व की प्राचीनतम भाषा तमिल में कहा था यादम उरे यावरुम केडीर यानी हम सभी स्थानों के लिए अपने पन का भाव रखते हैं और सभी लोग हमारे अपने हैं तो ग्लोबल वार्मिंग में भारत का योगदान बहुत ही कम रहा है लेकिन इसके समाधान के लिए कदम उठाने वालों में भारत एक अग्रणी देश है यूएन पीस कीपिंग मिशन में सबसे बड़ा बलिदान अगर किसी देश ने दिया है तो वो देश भारत है हम उस देश के वासी हैं जिसने दुनिया को युद्ध नहीं बुद्ध दिए हैं शांति का संदेश दिया है हमारी आवाज में आतंक के खिलाफ दुनिया को सतर्क करने की गंभीरता भी है और आक्रोश मानवता की खातिर आतंक के खिलाफ Exactly. So many good things are coming there. 
from there for their own country people, but like you said, doing stuff to help others to be a, a leader. Yeah. 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 yeah, everybody needs to come together in the Yeah. Yeah. Because it affects everyone Harmony all over the world. Yeah. And peace. Nobody's blaming one group. Just we need to work together to get rid of it. Yeah. Great scholar. Yes, that's what everybody needs all over the world. Yeah. He had lots of things inspired from Spotch Blarath, health insurance, financial, just so many good things that he brought to the table that they're doing in India, but some things that they want to make global or yeah. they want to be the leader, you know, and it's such a difference. They want to help other countries. Yeah. Modi is about development and peace and positive. Imran's cons was very gloom and doom and crying and looking for a handout and and then blaming others and talking about picking up guns like I I get I'm getting all anxiety just talking about him right now you don't even know like my heart started beating so fast that when Modi started talking like it slowly calmed down, you know. We yeah, talked because about of peace. the voice, like Imran Khan's like screaming. Yeah, and Modi's just like calm, like he's like, "I'm gonna say what I want to say." And he was talking peace, and he was talking, you know, Swatch Bharat, and and you know these financial, economic things that they've been doing, and health insurance, and you know, building roads and getting water and homes, and and you know, talking about you know, globally helping when disasters happen and just so many, one after the other, so many good things that India was doing for their own country, but trying to make global and trying to help others and just such a positive message, just such a great, um, just a way to kind of, you know, bring India into the light and, um, and it's just amazing. This speech really, you know, showed some true colors, you know, especially from Imran. And, you know, we have a lot of subscribers from all over. Um, and, and I don't want to give the impression, we don't want to give the impression that we're against Pakistan. We are not, not against, against Pakistan. We're not against anyone. We're, we're not against, against terrorists. any country. We're not against any religion. We are for peace. We love diversity. That's why we love India. We're half Indian. But... You know, when he gets up there and speaks about, you know, terrorist and speaks about bloodshed and picking up a gun and, you know, it just, that's not what you want for your country. That's not the image you want to portray to people um, about your country. You want to bring in some good things like the trees, like he planted a billion trees and he has And if he went off of that, it would have been much better. Right, yeah. If he had some other ideas, like these are some other things we want to do, and we, we don't just, have the funding for it. We need the funding for these ideas, then they would give you the funding for those ideas. I think if you went to other countries and said, this is my plan to help with global warming, but we only have this much money, we need some funding, you would get funding. If yeah. you had a plan to stop terrorists, and this is your plan, and you went and said, we need funding for this plan, you would get funding. People would fund you. If you had some good ideas that were solid, that was yeah. going to help your country grow and get better, people would give you money. But you can't come and talk terror and have a hand out. Like, I can think. I have money? Yeah. Like, for so, what? Exactly. Like, what do you need money for? To support terrorism? And that's not where you want. You want positive message. You want people to prosper. You want good things for your country. You know, if you live in Pakistan and you listen to this and, and you think about the last 70 years of trying to fight over Kashmir, 
you know, is that really what you want? Is that really, has that made more jobs for you? Has that made your life better? Or has it just made for angry people? I mean, that's how I felt listening to him. Like, yeah. it was building anger inside of me. And um, and I, I don't think that's how you want your country to prosper. You want no. good things to happen. You want a better economy. And, and to listen to that, you know, just sounded like he was going down the wrong path. He was going down the path of, you know, anger and terror. And, and this is what's going to end up happening as a war. And it, it hasn't helped, I don't think. Like, and, and I could be wrong. You guys can let us know. You know, is Pakistan prospering under this leadership? Or is it just making people more angry with the world that they're not doing enough? You know, I feel like, like I said, if he came with some ideas, I think people would fund him. I don't yeah. think that would be an issue. Even India, if you went to India and said, like, we need funding to make, you know, more trees, more economy, better jobs. We have these five great ideas. He came with a list of. He's like, we have a bunch of problems, but I'm only going to do four today. Well, what problems oh my God. do you help with? Like, That's how why you do start. you have those problems? Right. And money is an, is an issue. And I understand that, yeah. you know, you need money to do some of the great things to make things better, but you need to have some good ideas and then go to the U S go to Russia, go to China, go to these bigger countries that can give you funding and say, these are the five great ideas I have to make my country better. And then ask for money. And I think you would get it and support yeah. and, and fighting it against terror not asking people to pick up guns and talk about bloodshed yeah you know uh we love india and but we love everybody yeah as long as they're not terrorists yes we are not against violence peace is the answer gandhi's birthday is in a couple of days we're so excited like peace is the answer and making the world a better place and i think you know modi is on the right path and that is why india is prospering and and coming the next big thing last year was like one of the top countries you know not only for economic for environmental for health um you know they did the swatch bar they got toilets and they did um we just read in this one that health insurance for people that didn't have it people can use towards health insurance so they yeah. can go to the doctor they could get shots they could get checked that's just amazing and and he had lists of things that they were going to do even more and and that's just great and not only for india but for countries other countries to get involved you know having a disaster team that you know if if there's a flood in india he has a group of people but if there's a flood in another country and he can send his team there and some other countries can send their team there and hopefully that will just make the world a better place yeah and that's really what we want the world to be a wonderful place for everyone to live happily and prosper and you know good things to happen for everyone for pakistan for india for the world that is all we want so i hope you guys like this and if you like this video don't forget to click that like button down below because the more you like the more youtube shares our videos and don't forget to subscribe and join our wonderful family and we'll see you tomorrow bye, bye.